So with the spirit castle finished, Angela and Toshi safely back in town, or in our pocket, I want to do a quick bonus video looking over some of the things that I decided to bypass in the initial video. The first being that you might recall there were two additional dungeons here in the basement of the Alamo, and I decided to overlook them for a good number of reasons. I know I covered it up with some bullshit in the video, but in reality, yeah, it's just because I didn't really know the solution. And even now, I still am not 100% on the solution. It's definitely not doing a time that's just slightly ahead. Uh, in the case of the Dungeon of the Past, I wasn't sure if... I don't know, maybe they meant the time beforehand? But it's definitely not that. I mean, even though a ghoul did spawn. As far as I can tell, the ghoul just always spawns the first time you lay down the metal, no matter what. Like, even if it is right. So yeah, laying it an hour before does not count as the past. So instead, I was like, Ugh, maybe if I do it halfway backwards. That sounds stupid. I mean, there's no way that could work, right? Yeah, still works. No idea why. And this dungeon of the past is pretty much symmetrical to the dungeon of the present. It's just a short room and a long hallway leading to a very dead end. Nothing on the floor. There are some lamps to light up, but they don't really illuminate anything in here. So let's try out the dungeon of the future. Yet again, still not entirely sure what the expected solution to this is supposed to be, or the answer. I just kind of made a guess again, and I didn't think it would work. As I'm like, why would both the future and past be 10 o'clock? But, yeah, still, uh, still the right answer. And just as with the Dungeon of the Past and the Dungeon of the Present, the Dungeon of the Future is the exact same. Just a massive, massive waste of time. I mean, it's not really going to punish you too much, and I guess trial and error is a good part of puzzle solving. But yeah, it was a bit of a letdown to find out that the other dungeons, they don't even have anything cool in them. They are just completely symmetrical. So, the next thing I wanted to give a try, at least, and attempt to do, well, was first to try to get rid of Angela. And no matter how, no matter how hard I tried, no matter how long I waited, she would just never disappear. Akira! She would just always be there, so... Yeah, I uh, felt a little bit of exasperated about that, so I was thinking, what else could I do? What else could I do? And yeah, the next thing that struck me was, let's, get, let's see what we can do to get rid of Toshi. Now, I tried initially just to force the time forward, because I'm like, well, that's got to obviously kill him, but the game is amazingly smart enough to get around that. And I even thought, like, oh, maybe I have to kill the Minotaur first. But no, it still, it still blocked me, so... We're gonna have to go a little bit extreme with this. And by extreme, I mean take a very long nap. Yeah, I don't know if this is how they intended you to maybe do this, or maybe they just thought you would, I don't know, wait around in the previous room. Or maybe just walk around blindly for a while, but... Yeah, after wasting almost an entire day, Toshi is now dead. Oh no. We're too late. It's horrible. Paolo. 
I got worried, so I came to take a look. But I see we were too late. Yes. The other child was taken away, too. I see. Paolo, do you have any idea where I should look? Please tell me anything you can. Let's see. It's just a guess, but you could try looking in the underground dungeon in the South Tower. The only dungeon in this place are here and in that tower. The South Tower. How do I get there from here? Follow the passage on the west side of the castle southwards. Thanks. I'll go and check it out. Be careful. I really should go with you, you know. I'll be okay. All right. Take this, then. This is the item you used before, isn't it? Yes, it may come in handy. You use it the same way you did when you got out of the underground dungeon. Right. Thanks. That's okay. Well, I'd better be going. Okay. Well, let's go. Okay. Hooray, and that made the trip very much worth it. So with that out of the way, we can give Toshi's body a quick check and find out just exactly what he is 